So I've kind of dodged this question before when asked on social media because there's no black and white answer. My answer is gray and I like to have the conversation with my clients about it. And so I think I feel nervous giving this blanket information and people thinking it's a yes or a no. The reason I'm a bit wishy-washy about it is because they are over-marketed saying that you know, if you wear them, it'll make you skinny or you won't get a diastasis or it'll make your diastasis go away, which is not the case. You, you need to do muscle activation to improve diastasis and no belt is going to stop you from stretching when you're pregnant. A lot of women tend to wear them very tight, cinched up really tight all the time postpartum. And you've probably heard that that can cause prolapse or worsening of prolapse. I don't know, to be honest, if that's the case, if it would do that, but I definitely would be hesitant for the women that had um, like a, a difficult vaginal delivery with a fair amount of tearing or trauma or soreness down there. I'd be hesitant to increase a bunch of pressure over top. I just don't see how that would be helpful. And I've had a few clients come in that have said to me, I swear that the band I wore during um, my postpartum, my first week's postpartum made this prolapse worse. And so maybe. I don't mean to put this big dark cloud over them because I actually recommend them a lot to women when I see them in the clinic because then I can talk about it with them and I can talk about their symptoms with them and things to watch out for. So I'm a huge fan of them for comfort. So whether it is like some of the belly bands or um, some of those compression sleeves or compression bands or tights that, that are being sold now, Honestly, if, if it's for a, for comfort purposes and you're not wearing it all the time and really tight after, I think it can be really beneficial. I tend to say that because I wore, I actually purchased the Belly's Ink band um, and I really liked it. I did not wear it all the time. I wore it, I felt really exposed and I would say kind of vulnerable when I went to bed at night. So laying on my side, I felt like all oh, my guts were coming out. I had a really big diastasis and so my tissues and my my muscles weren't supporting that very well. So I wore it for comfort a lot at night, like loosely done up. And then I would wear it off and on during the day, especially when I would start getting back to exercise. I'd put it on because I felt like it helped me feel my muscles better. Um, so I would do kind of a round of my exercises with it on, and then I would take it off and try to replicate that, that feeling again with my muscles. So I definitely think that there's a time and a place and I recommend them quite a bit, but I, um, I am hesitant to just say everyone should wear it and should do it up tight.